And here we go. Okay, it's your boy back in the house, Maurice the Great from MauriceTheGreat.com. And in today's podcast video, I want to tell you guys about a great book that should inspire anyone who is thinking about becoming their own boss or becoming an entrepreneur. Okay? This book review is about a book called Black Fortunes. Okay? And Black Fortunes is a book about the first black millionaires that became millionaires during slavery times. Now when I say during slavery times, you know, most people think slavery ended in 1865. But do you honestly believe that after the slaves were freed, that everything was all good? I think not. It probably was 60 years after slavery, hard to do shit or stuff. Excuse my French. <clears throat> okay, but this book will inspire you because the people that this book details made it against all odds I mean could you imagine these people didn't even have telephones they didn't have the internet they couldn't network market now a lot of people believe that the first black millionaire was Madam CJ Walker which she was the first black millionaire who could show her wealth if you was a millionaire and you were black, you couldn't flaunt your wealth. Okay? It it's probably was a bunch of millionaires before her, but they couldn't just pop up in a mansion and back then uh, have your own train car or your own uh, stage coach or whatnot. You had to blend in. You probably could be rich around other black people. But you couldn't be too flossy and rich around white people. Okay. So a lot of these people who became millionaires during that time. Couldn't flaunt their wealth. Unless they could pass for white. Now in this book you do have a couple people who are what we call mixed race. Meaning their mom was black and their dad was white or their mom was white and their dad was black so if you could pass for white you could flaunt your wealth the thing that inspired me the most about this book is that people took what they had and made it work they took lemons they made lemonade so as I look at what we have available to us today we shouldn't have any excuse for not being able to see, succeed in whatever we put our minds to. Okay. Uh, also, three of the people uh, spotlighted in this book are women. So, black women, bravo, been getting it. Some of the first black millionaires were black women. Okay, so, I'm going to recommend that anybody, no matter if you're black or white, Okay, because I'm not really a, into race and all of this here. I do support my race, but I'm not a racist, and I support, you know, I like whoever like me. Okay, I'm gonna just leave it at that. But this is a great book if you if you wanna know the real history of black wealth in America, Black Fortunes is a great book to pick up. I had an audio book. Okay, and the reason I got the audio book is because you can listen to it in your car. You can slap on your headphones and listen to it when you're uh, working out or at work. I like to listen to it when I'm cutting my grass or whatever kind of house chores I'm doing. So also, you can get this book for free. Okay, and I'm going to tell you how you get it for free. I'm going to put a link below to Amazon.com. If you click that link and you choose audio book from Audible's, they give you the book 30 days for free okay and if you like the audible's platform and if you're a avid book reader then you'll love to use audible.com so 
check this book out if you get it hey we might start a little book club this won't be the only book that I'll review on my channel so look forward to me recommending other books and most of the books that I'm gonna recommend will be re uh, revolving around entrepreneur entrepreneurship starting your own business uh, uh, tips and tricks to get your life on track maybe a couple on the law of attraction because I really I really use that in my life so I want to thank you guys for taking the time out to watch this video there will be a description for or a link in the description for you can check out this book uh, thanks for being a subscriber have a great day